The concept continues to blow my mind. It really will enable astronauts to explore. Dr. Pascal Lee has literally gone to the ends of the Earth to test equipment for NASA. We want astronauts to go to Mars, be effective explorers, to pick up rocks, to examine fossils potentially, to look for life. All these things require dexterity. When it's pressurized, the spacesuit becomes rigid. Astronauts have a very hard time moving anything. The fingers are difficult to move. At a conference in Norway, Lee happened to meet some engineering students with a possible solution. The guy was just wearing a glove, waving his hands, literally, flying this very complex piece of equipment, this drone, very precisely. It didn't take rocket science to figure, figure out that this had rocket science applications. Pascal invited us to join the NASA Hot Mars project for the summer, which was incredible. To do our field testing, we go to Devon Island in the Arctic. We call Devon Island Mars on Earth. This glove is a first attempt to create a, an interface that allows the astronaut, with very subtle finger motions, to have these motions translated wirelessly into commands for a robotic system. Success is leading to more collaboration with the students, who formed a company called Intention. This year, we're going to test operation of other activities, such as control of an ATV. Hello. The smart glove can do many things, Hello. but it cannot warn of approaching polar bears. For that, there is Apollo. Matt Dibble for VOA News, Mountain View, California.